In today's video, I am doing a underwater mob battle against my best friend Cam. But what Cam doesn't know is I'm secretly using this one-way glass to cheat. Meaning I could see any mob he places down and I will have the perfect counter. For example, if Cam places down a villager, I could place down a zombie and I will easily win. This video is going to be a lot of fun, so make sure you subscribe. All right, Cam, are you ready for today's underwater mob battle? I am super duper ready and my silence looks so sick look at this yeah well my side looks super cool too but you'll have to see it whenever we get ready for the first round all right i am definitely loving this arena yeah i think this is our best arena yet all right anyway go back to your side so we can go ahead and do the first round all right getting ready for round one all we have to do is look through this one-way glass and see whatever mob cam places down and it looks like he's spawning in drowns but they, they look different. These don't look like normal drowns. I don't know what these things are. And oh my gosh, Cam is spawning in so many of these. But luckily, I can see exactly what he's spawning in. So I can have the perfect counter. So if we go into my creative inventory, we can just grab a great thrasher. And this mob is really scary. So if we go ahead and place down one of these thrashers, you can see that it is super scary. I mean, look at those teeth. So Cam placed down a bunch of those drowned things. So I'm going to place down a bunch of these thrashers. And hopefully that should be enough to get rid of those drowned. And it looks like Cam is actually building a statue of his drowned. So while he's distracted, I want to go mess with him. So if we go into our creative inventory, we can just grab a potion of invisibility. And if I drink this, I should be completely invisible. But I have to take off my squid hat because if I don't, it'll just look like a floating squid. And then I could just go over to Cam's side and he's building a trident for his drowned statue. And oh my gosh, he spawned so many and he looks distracted right now. So I'm just going to kill a couple of these drowned and that should be good. Okay, I'm going to go back over to my side before Cam even realizes that anything happened. So there we go. We are back with my thrashers and I need to put my squid hat back on and I cannot forget to drink milk because if I don't, I will still be invisible. And now we just have to see if Cam is ready for the first round. Hey Cam, are you ready for round one? I am super duper ready and my army looks so scary. Yeah, I don't even know what kind of drown those are, but but they look super scary. Wait, how do you know that I have drowns? Where are you? Are you cheating? No, I'm not cheating. I can just hear them. This wall is like super thin for some reason. I can't hear through bedrock. What are you talking about? No, Cam, I can definitely hear them. But anyways, are you ready for the first round? I am ready and my mobs are definitely going to win. I wouldn't be so sure about that, but I'm going to get rid of the wall in three, two, one. Here are my thrashers. What in the world are those things? They are demolishing my army. Come on, fight back. Look, drowned. they're just picking up your drones and shaking them. Oh my gosh, what in the world are these things? Oh, the drone just killed him. Come on, you got this. Cam, I don't think your drone have any chance against my thrashers. Uh, it seems to me like they're fighting back. Look at this one. This one's about to kill one. Wait, Cam, I think you're down to your last drowned. And it's, oh I think it's dead. Wait, no, it's right here. It's right here. I think this is your last round right here. Oh my gosh, come on, you got this. Fight back, you got this. No! Oh my gosh, these thrashers are so overpowered. Uh, I didn't even know they did that little shake move. I didn't even know that these were a thing. Yeah, well, you should have done research on the ocean. Well, I thought the drowns were like the only mob in Minecraft that could deal damage in the water. Well, Cam, you're super wrong because we have four more rounds and there are a bunch of more mobs. Oh my gosh. Well, let's clean up the arena and get ready for round two. Oh my gosh those thrashers were so overpowered i honestly wasn't expecting that but getting ready for round two all we have to do is look through this one-way glass and we can see whatever mob cam places down and i don't even know what mobs these are they look like fish but it doesn't even look like they could do any damage but i'm not gonna underestimate them and cam is placing down a bunch of these guys oh my gosh 
Well, I need a mob that can attack really fast and does a lot of damage. So if we go into my creative inventory, we can just look up a drowned necromancer. There we go. And if we just place some of these down, you can see that they look super cool. They're like drowned with little capes and tridents. And the cool thing about these mobs is that sometimes when they attack, they actually summon in more drowned. So these mobs are actually really cool. And I think that should be enough against Cam's army. I mean, I don't even think these mobs do any damage. And it looks like Cam actually built a statue of his mobs, but I thought of a really funny troll. Instead of going over to Cam's side, I actually want to build this exactly on my side, but replace that yucky blue. Let me just grab some red wool and some orange wool. And we also need some black for the eyes. And I think if I just go ahead and do this, and then that is red for four block and then orange. And then it should be three red and another orange. And now all I have to do is the tail. And there we go. That is an exact copy of Cam statue, just with some better colors. And I think that's actually time for round two. So let's see if Cam is ready to get rid of the wall. Hey, Cam, are you ready for the second round? I am super ready. And there is no way you're going to see me as soon as you drop the wall. I am blending in so well with my army. Oh, so is your army like blue? No, really? Yeah, that's a pretty good guess but my army is kind of blue well cam you're gonna be surprised because i actually spent some time this round building an awesome statue i spent time building an awesome statue too and it's of my army and it looks super duper awesome well i can guarantee you that my statue looks even better but i'm gonna get rid of this wall in three two one here are my drowned necromancers what is they are necromancers that drown and look they have tridents and they're just throwing them all at your army oh my gosh nick look one of my fish are fighting back look wait your fish actually do damage yeah look at look he's doing so much damage to this necromancer i didn't think your fish actually did damage wait Cam, why are you punching my necromancers you're not a fish no it's the it's my fish it looks just like me look it's a squid no it has a name tag i see you i don't know what you're talking about this i'm gonna I'm going to start punching your mobs. Fine. I'll give up the charade, but my army is dealing so much damage to your necromancers. Look at that one. He's stuck in a corner. Come on, rockfish. You guys got this. Wait, these are called rockfish. They don't even look like rocks. They look like rocks to me. Oh my gosh, Cam. Look at the trident rain that is happening. Oh my gosh. Stay out of the way, rockfish. Stay out of the way. Wait, Nick. Why is there so many fish floating up here? Why are they all dying? It's because my drowned necromancers are hitting them with tridents and i think they're actually getting a one shot oh my gosh you'll have so many left in your army cam there are so many tridents look it's lagging my game oh my gosh it's lagging mine too oh my gosh cam you're down to your last two rockfish no come on guys you got this come on necromancers you have to hit your tridents yes come on keep going yes okay cam you're down to your last one right here oh my gosh Oh, and there he goes. He tried to run away. No. Wait a second, Nick. What is this? This is the statue of the fish that I built. Doesn't it look awesome with the colors orange and red? No, it doesn't look awesome. I built the same statue right here in a better color. Wait, how did you copy my exact statue? Did you cheat? No, I built mine first. Uh, no, you didn't because I built this before the round even started. Well, I built this before the arena was even created. Oh, yeah, then why wasn't here in round one? Because you couldn't see it because it was that good. I uh, Kim, I think you're lying. I think you're cheating. How could I be cheating? You're the one who's cheating. I built this statue perfectly and you changed it into your ugly colors. I built this statue perfectly and you changed it to your ugly colors. You know what? Let's just just get the arena ready for round three and you need to stop cheating all right on to round three all we have to do is win these last three rounds and we will win the entire mob battle we just have to look through this one way glass and see what cam is placing down and it looks like he's placing down some sort of crab and honestly these things look really cute they have a bunch of colors but i really like these orange ones because everyone knows orange is the best color but 
Cam is placing down a lot of these crabs. Oh my gosh, he's still going. Okay, well, I need a mob that can do a huge attack and hopefully take out a bunch of these crabs. So if we go into my creative inventory, we can look up a thresher. And oh my gosh, he's still placing down these crabs. How many does he need? And if we just go ahead and place down this thresher, this thing is huge. But the thresher has an attack where it's like a whirlpool and it drags all the mobs inside. So hopefully this should be super useful against all of those crabs. But I'm going to go ahead and place down a few more just in case the crabs manage to actually kill one of the threshers but i don't believe that's possible so hopefully four should be enough and it looks like cam is placing down a bunch of money are they supposed to be a bunch of mr crabs like from spongebob and because cam has so many crabs i'm just gonna go over to his side and take out a couple of only the blue one because everyone knows blue is a stupid color so if we just grab an invisibility potion we can drink this making me completely invisible and i can't forget to take off my squid hat and if we just go around to cam's side he has so many crabs but there are a lot of blue ones and cam's distracted placing down the money so i could just get rid of these blue blue crabs right here and hopefully he didn't see that all right just a couple more blue crabs right here and i don't want to get too close so i'm gonna go all the way over to this side and blue crab blue crab get rid of that one and there's a blue crab there blue crab there and you know what i think that's good i don't want to get caught and you know what a couple of the blue ones can live but now i'm just gonna go back over to my side before cam notices and hopefully he won't i mean there's like a billion blue crabs left but now i need to grab milk because if i don't i will still be invisible so let's just drink that and we also need to put back on our squid hat and let's see if cam is ready for the third round cam are you ready for round three yeah i'm ready and i have the shiniest army ever cam the only thing shiny on your side is that giant pile of money wait how do you know i have a giant pile of money where are you you have to be cheating i heard all those coins like shaking around in your pocket you can't hear through bedrock i don't know what you're talking about i definitely can but anyways are you ready for the third round i am ready well cam i'm gonna get rid of the wall in three two one here are my threshers what in the world they're just picking up all my crabs <laughs> they are doing their whirlpool attack and yes this is exactly what i wanted gosh come on crab they're doing the whirlpool attack and they're just throwing them up into the well not air but water and they're just eating them oh my gosh come on there's so many of you crabs you got this on. yeah kim why did you spawn so many crabs they're so tiny so i thought they would help in numbers yeah, I don't know if that was a good idea because look, this one just has them trapped at the ceiling. Oh, and look, all the crabs are just going into the whirlpools. Oh my gosh, come on. Oh my gosh, Cam, look, all of your crabs are on the wall. They're hiding. This isn't crabs, they're coral. What are you talking about? Oh, I thought your crabs were just hiding from my giant threshers. No, my crabs are getting attacked by your threshers. Oh, and look, Cam, you're down to your last couple crabs, and they're just being sucked into the whirlpools. Oh, my gosh. Oh, my crabs are dead? What happened? I had so many. I think just the four whirlpools were no match for them. Oh, my gosh. They're just being flung around the arena. Come on, I believe in you. Oh, and look, Cam, there's a blue and an orange crab on the floor right here who do you think will be last i think the blue is gonna be last because blue is a better color well the orange one is still on the floor the blue one just got sucked up by the whirlpool where did they even go where are the rest of my crabs i think they just got thrown into the wall and died wait nick i don't see any more of my crabs where did they all go i think they died i think these are the last of your crabs right here this item Gosh. well i'll just go ahead and claim my prize money so so thank you for all this gold and all that. No, this is not yours. This is not yours. This is not yours. This is mine. Well, then why'd you place it down if it wasn't for me? For my crabs that were going to win until you placed down your cheating mob. How is that cheating? He has a whirlpool. Well, anyways, Cam, I won fair and square. So let me just take all this money and let's clean up the arena and get ready for round four. Those threshers were so overpowered. Cam's crabs stood no chance. Those whirlpools did so much damage. But now getting ready for round four, all we have to do is look 
through this one-way glass and we could see whatever underwater mob cam places down and what even are those they look kind of like the rockfish i don't even know what these things are but i'm not going to underestimate them because the rockfish did do damage so these things might actually do damage as well but i need to think of a really good mob because cam actually placed down a couple of these things so if we go into the creative inventory we can just grab a mob called neptuno and if we place him down you can see that he is super cool looking he's like half mermaid half seahorse half human half drowned half something i don't even know and he looks ready to fight so we're just gonna place down a couple of these neptunos and that should be perfectly enough for cam's fish army i don't even know what these are and it looks like cam is building another statue out of that yucky blue wool i think that's supposed to be a squid but i really don't like those colors so i I'm gonna go do something about it. If we just grab an invisibility potion from our creative menu, we can drink it and I will be completely invisible. And I also have to take off my squid helmet because the squid helmet will just be floating. And now coming on over to Cam's side, it looks like he's just swimming with the fishes. So that gives me a perfect opportunity while he's distracted. I can just go ahead and type in this command and this will replace the blue wool with a better color like orange. All right, squids, I hope you enjoyed Enjoy your statue. I took so long on it. And what in the world? Why is it this ugly orange? Oh my gosh, I need to change it back. All right, there we go. All normal. I didn't expect Cam to know the command as well. Okay, well, I need to just completely destroy it then. So Cam's distracted. I can just go right into here. I can just grab a piece of TNT and a flat and steel. And if I just place this right here and light the TNT, it should blow up the entire statue. Wait, what was that? Oh my gosh, what happened to my statue? And there we go. If it can't be orange, then Cam can't have it. So I'm just going to go back to my side and I can't forget to put on my squid hat and drink milk because if I don't, I will still be invisible when the round starts. And let's check on Cam to see if he's ready for the fourth round. Hey Cam, are you ready for round four? Yeah, I'm ready, but I don't know what happened to my statue. What do you mean? God blew up. I don't even know where my statue is right now. It's just a bunch of wool. Wait, your statue blew up? How? We're underwater. TNT can't explode underwater. I don't know. Well, that's really weird. I'm kind of scared now for what mob you have. I mean, maybe it just blew up the statue because it was like something stupid like blue. But anyways, are you ready for the third round? Hey, blue's not stupid and yeah, I am ready. Well, Kev, I am going to get rid of the wall in three, two, one. Here are my Neptunos. What are these? They're like half seahorse, half man, half drowned, half something, I don't even know. And they are super strong. And look, they are just prodding your little fish things with their tridents. Wait, do your fish ink? Are these squids? Yeah, they're not fish, they're squids. How did you not know that? Because squids don't really look like that. I mean, look at my hat. I'm wearing a squid hat. I'm wearing a squid too. Of course I know what a squid looks like. That looks more like a drowned, really. No, this is a glow squid hat. It looks so cool. Yeah, I don't really know. And wait, Cam, where's your army? Wait a minute. Where did they all go? I just see a bunch of like floating pieces. I think my Neptuno just completely tore through your entire army. Oh my gosh, not again. Well, Cam, we have to clean up your side of the arena so we can get ready for the final round those neptunos were so overpowered but i have an even better mob picked for this final round so all we have to do is look through this one-way glass and see whatever mob cam places down and oh my gosh what kind of fish are these they look really silly it kind of looks like they have duck bills on their face but it doesn't even matter what kind of mobs these are because i have the perfect mob pick so if we go into our creative inventory we can just grab the ghost of Captain Cornelia. Now, this may not seem like an underwater mob, but this boss is so overpowered. This mob can teleport to the enemies it's attacking, and whenever it dies, it actually respawns and summons in like four drowned with trident. So this boss is a little overpowered. And actually, if I just go ahead and kill one, it should spawn in those tridents. And look, it is insanely overpowered. 
overpowered. So yeah, I might just do that a couple times as well as spawning in three more of these. And look, the drowned are doing a little happy dance because they know that they're gonna win. And what is Cam even building? It looks like a Pokeball. I don't know what Cam is building, but I actually... Oh wait, no, it's not a Pokeball. It's a little thing from Mario, I, the, the fish thing. Well, I don't think I actually wanna mess with Cam for this round because I actually wanna see if he gets to finish this build. So let's see if he's ready for the final round. Cam, are you ready for the final round? Yes, I am ready. And I think my army is definitely gonna win. Yeah, what kind of fish are these? They look like they have like duck bills. Wait, how do you know my fish looks like duck? One swam over to my side. I don't even know how. I think you're cheating because this is like completely surrounded and there's bedrock blocking us. I think there was a little hole in the wall. I don't know what happened, but one of them came to my side and I didn't spawn in it. Oh, I still think you're cheating because there is no way my fish can get to your side. Well, maybe your fish are more powerful than you know and they broke bedrock. But anyways, are you ready for the final round? Yes, I am ready. All right, Campbell, I'm gonna get rid of the wall in three, two, one. Here is my army of drowned and my bosses are up here. You gotta get down. Oh my gosh, come on guys. Oh, and look, my bosses came down. My bosses of Captain Cornelia's. And look, they're just teleporting all over the place. Oh my gosh, they're one-shotting my Papawees. Papawees? Yeah, that's what they're called and they're super strong or at least i thought they were oh my gosh i can't even tell what's happening wait kim where even are you right here oh i couldn't even tell that was you because i thought you were one of the drowned come on guys you gotta win my bosses are just teleporting all over the place and killing your papawees oh my gosh and look there's just trident scattered everywhere come on kim you know what to make it easier on you i will go ahead and kill one of my bosses just to make it a tiny bit easier oh. Oh, that sounds super good for me. Yeah, go ahead and do that. Here, here, here you go. I'll just kill one of my bosses. And look, it's spawned in more drowned. What? How is that fair? And look, I'll spawn in more. Oh my gosh, how is that fair? But wait, Nick, where is the rest of my army? Where did they all go? I think your army's already dead. And they're just attacking each other because they're bored. Oh my gosh. Gosh, well, Nick, what did you think about my build? I really like this build a lot. It's the fish from Mario, right? Yeah, it's a cheap cheap from Mario. Yeah, it's a really good build, but Cam, this isn't a build battle. It's a mob battle and I won. Well, Cam, we have to clean up the arena so we can film the outro. All right, Cam, come on over to my side so we can film the outro. If you enjoyed this underwater mob battle video, then make sure to subscribe because me and Cam have a bunch of videos coming out like this where I win wait, every wait, 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 single wait, wait, mob wait, wait, battle. Wait, wait, wait. What, Cam? What, what, what? Why is your side cost you were cheating? I wasn't cheating. I think your little flopper thing from Mario just messed up my entire side. No, look, my side's still bedrock and your side's still glass. And you were cheating. You were cheating. You were cheating. I wasn't cheating. I win. Bye.